I was wondering why I wasn't appearing on the screen. I had my PNG tuber source hidden. Anyway, how's it going, everybody? My name is Tentacle, and... Uh-oh. Uh, uh, um... Pretend you didn't see my octoling in those clothes. Yeah, my name is Tentacle, and welcome back to more Splatoon 3. We're here for the funny Splatoon 3 Ma Rainmaker Challenge. Bing, bing, boom, let's do it. I am so freaking excited! I hope you guys are too. Anyway, who do we got in the chat? We got... We got Scarlet, we got Tyler, we got Prox, we got Tuesday, Mr. Cheese, Saw Sandra... Anyone else? That looks like it's everybody. Oh, and uh, Splatoon Girl 2023. Welcome to the stream. And welcome Chula May to the stream. I'm sorry I don't really remember your name, but if it has been a while, then welcome back. Oh, uh, and for the record, the reason why I was acting so startled was because that specific outfit is for a really important project, and I wasn't ready to reveal it just yet. That's sadly something I won't be able to reveal until next year. But trust me, the payoff is gonna be huge. If I can get this to work. Okay! So, since it has been a while since I've played a challenge in this game, let me go over the rules a little bit. The rules are pretty much the same as my private battle rules, in that I'm the one who makes the rooms. We do that via my stream pool, which is... this... And you gotta stay here on this menu after you've joined my pool in order to join my room. Also, what's up, King Octo? Welcome to the stream. However, because this is a challenge, you guys only get to play in one lobby, and every lobby will have five games. Because five games is the amount you need in order to get your challenge power. Once the challenge power has been calculated, I will reset the lobby. That way it'll be fair for everyone. Oh, okay, good. We got a full lobby. You know what? No, I have a better idea. I am going to play... Hmm. I swear I had an idea before I started this stream. What the heck was it? Ah, yes, there we go, the Forge Pro. This team needs range anyway. But yeah, the reason why I had to delay the stream a little bit was because... I was out of the house for most of today, and by the time I got back, there were <laughs> there would have been only five minutes left until I had to start my stream, and I was nowhere close to ready. I actually just got back from the gym. I've been trying to amp up the difficulty of my workouts recently, and that's what I did today. I am so going to be feeling the burn tomorrow. But yeah, check out how crazy this Rainmaker challenge is. I'm going to wait until we actually see someone grab the Rainmaker to explain it a little further. Gotcha. We're being flanked! This is not good. No one's grabbing the Rainmaker, though, so I guess that's fine. I will not hesitate to switch to the Wiper Deco if I have to. 
Well, I guess I can actually explain it now. Check this out. Three spread shots from a single Rainmaker shot. Is that not insane? Not only that, if you're carrying the Rainmaker, you essentially have a Tacticooler active. When I discovered that last night, and I discovered how awesome this challenge would be, I just had to stream it. This is easily setting up to be the most fun challenge of them all. That's totally understandable though, Scarlet. You gotta put your personal health first. Okay, I can see where this challenge is going. I guess I'm already gonna have to be switching to the Wiper Deco. Or maybe not the Wiper Deco. I'll probably think of something. Seeing someone using a Tacticooler weapon did give me an idea, though. What if I played a weapon with the cooler so we basically had those buffs all the time? Also, what's up, GoVA? Welcome to the stream. Don't leave yet, by the way. We got four more games in this lobby. Alright, time to be an obnoxious NZAP player and just get in the enemy's face. Believe it or not, this specific setup right here will work for that, uh, it'll work for that premise. There is also a very real chance I'll be making a short out of this stream. It's so, it's gonna be so much fun. And I would also like to take this time to mention... Locker Lowdown Part 3 is entering its editing phase. I did record that video over the weekend. I am currently on track to releasing that video by the end of the month. And I want to do that before Halloween. Because I have plans. Wait, what? Did we just... Ah, oh, come on. We really just encountered the same team. This isn't gonna be fun. And the worst part is they're playing the exact same weapons. It's just that our ink colors are reversed. And I'm surprised that hit me. Ooh, you had a five and three? Streak, saw Sandra. That's pretty good. Someone else grab it. I'm going to see if I can go be obnoxious. Actually, never mind. I'll grab it. Ha! Ah, I took the lead unorthodoxedly. Yes, that's a word. Get out of here. Get out of here. Oh, no. Thanks for the assist, guys. Wow. <laughs> If you just group all three of the Rainmaker shots together, you can insta-splat a player. It's so good. I'm going to see if I can charge up my Tacticooler before I jump in. Something tells me playing cooler was the right choice. I'm sticking with this weapon. Payback is a dish best served cold, I think. GG's.
Oh, by the way, Prox, I might need to snag those or snag some of your gear from you after this lobby is over because I've been looking for some new gear. I hope you don't mind. All right, let's see. Oh, yeah, Tuesday. Good choice there, man. Get two cooler weapons and two splatter shots on the field. We'll be pretty much unstoppable. All right, let's see who we got next. All right, new people. And nice, we got my ink color. I love this shade of purple. It's so good. Hmm. I thought I had something else I wanted to talk about. But for the life of me, I can't remember what it is. Oh, dear. Now here comes the standoff, present in every Rainmaker match. Okay, I took down one of them. Thank you, Prox. Imagine you run into us. I wouldn't doubt it, Scarlet. In the past, I've accidentally stream sniped Grydith during one of the challenges. You guys remember that, right? I believe that was during the second run of the Rainmaker, or Rainmaker, Random Weapon Challenge. Get them! Okay. Ouch. Avenge me, friends. Oh no. Yeah, I was I was pretty much dead on arrival. Ooh, nice. Okay. That was in time with the music. See if you can, I don't know. I was going to say do the Rainmaker reset strat, but that works too. I guess you can't really do that strategy on a map like this. Nice wipeout! Uh, hmm. I'm trying to figure out the best way to put this, Splatoon girl. I hate to be that guy, but unfortunately, I think that's just the overall status of the player base. Everyone's gonna be more competitive in this game. Challenge or not. Trust me, I've learned that the hard way from how many hundreds of hours I've put into this game. But the thing is, the thing I've learned is you can't let that get to your head. You have to make sure to just keep your cool and play your best. I learned that all the way back in Splatoon 2. Speaking of which, I do want to return to uh, Splatoon 2 at some point to do another private battle stream. First time I did that after Splatoon 3 came out, that was fun, and I want to try that again. Also, what's up, Tricolor? How you doing? Let's get him, Saw Sandra. Eh, worth a shot. Splatfest reruns confirmed, if only Tricolor. I was just saying that I kind of want to do another Splatoon 2 private battle stream in the distant future. I don't know when, though. Nice placement on the cooler there, Tuesday. Oh, why did I do that? I should not have approached. My bad. 
Thanks for the Avenge, at least. Get out of here, stupid machine player. I'm going for it! I'm no longer going for it. One of these days, I'll learn to not open my mouth whenever I'm doing well. Anyway. Thank you for that. They did the reset trick. Dang it. I'm just gonna do that. Someone's got to get that Hydra. Got it. That was actually surprisingly easy. And that was almost a wipeout. No! Oh, come on! How was that not a an overtime thing? What the heck? I call shenanigans on that. We could have made that, right, guys? Ugh. Shenanigans. Also, what's up, Taylor? Welcome to the stream. By the way, guys, I don't know if you noticed, but I changed the title of the stream from Modded Rainmaker to Modified Rainmaker. I think I did a good job with that. Hey, 14 KOs. That's not bad for my playing the end zap. I usually do a lot worse. Also, what's up, Nathan L? Welcome to the stream. I was malding in air quotes because we had a chance to get an overtime win in the last battle and I just barely missed my chance because I got splatted at the Rainmaker or by the Rainmaker in like the last 10 seconds. It was no fun. Okay though, apart from the Charger, this team seems way more reasonable to handle. I'm okay with this. And I just barely avoided the jaws of death right there. See, the way this works, Nathan, is... This is a modified version of the Rainmaker. It shoots three projectiles when fully charged instead of just one. It has a shorter timer, and you basically have a tactic cooler active while carrying it. This is an official challenge. Get out of here. There we go. That took way too long. You're not gonna fool me, Charger. Nice job on getting the ink brush, at least. There's the blob blobber. And there's the charger. I'm going for it. Stand back. Sounds like I'm trying to sing the song Everybody Plays the Fool. I'll be taking that checkpoint, thank you. Go get the cooler. I just need one little push. There we go. That is what I love to see. And the thing is, because of how this Rainmaker works, matches can end in seconds. And that's good because I don't like long, drawn out Rainmaker battles. And this is one of my favorite ranked modes in the game normally. They just made it 10 times more fun. 
There you go, Prox. Avenged. And I got splatted. I don't know what song that is, Scarlet. It sounds cool, though. What? What the heck? This is just not my game today, huh? Did that not even... Oh, it didn't even do anything. So I basically have to restart my challenge power. All right. Hmm. How are we going to do this? Am I actually... No. Don't you dare, game. How long is a little while? You guys are seeing this, right? Normally, it's like... Normally, Nintendo says... Your previous online play session didn't end naturally, so we're gonna have to drop the hammer. Please wait X amount of minutes and try again. Right? But... Look at that! What am I supposed to do? How long am I supposed to wait? Also, welcome back, Mr. Cheese. I disconnected from a battle and now I have to wait for an indefinite amount of time. Ugh, uh, come on. That's right, Nathan, I am being bullied. Some higher-up doesn't want me to have fun in this challenge, but darn it, I will have fun. You can't stop me, game. You hear me? Hmm. Dang, I'm still a little short on cash. Maybe putting this song on will make me feel better. That's a little better, at least. And yep, 20 USD per year. That is entirely true, Prox. Alright then, I will try to reopen the game. Oh, oops. I forgot to do one other thing. There we go. Now the V802 tube window is not getting in my way. That's enough out of you, game. Also, what's up, Q? Welcome to the stream. We're just... We're just all collectively mauling over the fact that I disconnected for no reason. And now I have to wait who knows how long to, uh... What's the word? To reconnect. And hey, I got a new emote. Ooh, okay, that's pretty good. I might use that for this stream. Oh, Splatoon 3 for sure has terrible servers, Splatoon Girl. That's no secret. The servers in the servers in Splatoon 3 are handled differently compared to 2, so the connection is definitely worse. I just don't get why I randomly disconnected. Well, I guess that's an obvious reason, but uh, there we go. We're back in it. I'm not going to count that first lobby so anyone can join this one. And yep, Tricolor is the one that said what I should do. That's also true, Tuesday. The whole 50 USD per year if you have the expansion pass. Yeah, it is peer-to-peer -peer servers. Truly the idea of all time. 
as much as I want to play my beloved Heavy Deco or Heavy Edit, I don't think I can in a challenge like this, though. Also, ready up Tuesday. We're waiting on you. There we go. Now, I know the description says I might be playing something else today, but that really just depends on what else I can do. Not in Splatoon 3, just in my games in general. I checked my Pokemon Violet mass outbreaks earlier, but I don't even remember what they were because I was dead tired when I did that. I might play a little bit of F-099. I don't know. Also, wow. Hang on a second. That 52 gal player is using an incredibly inappropriate username. We gotta deliver them to justice. By the way, chat, remind me to block that person after... After this lobby is over. This kind of... Uh, this kind of rudeness will not fly. Aw, oh, man! Thought I got him. Oh, well. The Tenta Missiles got him, so thank you, Tricolor. I mean, reporting might also work. I don't know. I'm just trying to think of something. There. I splatted him at least once. My goal was accomplished. Ah, okay. You can't just do that. Exactly, Prox. You can't say that on television. Ooh, a boxing glove type weapon. That would be pretty cool, Nathan. Now, just for the record, before anyone gets mad at me, I don't want you to dogpile this person. Just block them if you can. If you're in this lobby. Hmm. Oh, wait, never mind. I know what we're supposed to do. It has to be on the Splatnet app on the Switch Online app. So that's going to have to be later. I think. I don't even remember. Yes, it was them, Mr. Cheese. It does? Hmm. I'm gonna have to look at that after this lobby is over. But yeah, please don't dogpile this person. Just report him and move on. It's not worth it, honestly. But seriously, though, that type of disrespect will not fly anywhere not even just in my stream just anywhere oh boy let's put that in the past and continue before we focus on that too long in the meantime i'm gonna plug in my computer wait hold up did we just stream snipe another youtuber i think we just did that L3D player! I recognize that username! I'm pretty sure we just stream sniped Aiden. Yeah, we totally just stream sniped Smaiden. <laughs> I am definitely gonna go into their chat after this and say GG's, no matter who wins. Because that's hilarious. There we go. Ouch. Oh, the Dread Ringer got me. I thought Aiden got me. 
Yeah, that one went by too fast. But I'm still gonna say GG's. Unfortunately, that's not clip worthy. There we go. Yeah, they're live. Nice. Hang on a second. I'll stop the replay buffer for now. Let's see. Darn you ads. I want to see the stream. GG's LMAO. I gotta... There we go. Hmm. I'm trying to see if I can wait for their response. Okay, Aiden didn't respond, but chat was having a field day with it, so that's pretty much the same. Also, what's up, Dylan and Flagman? Welcome to the stream. I am definitely enjoying this challenge, but unfortunately, I got disconnected completely at random at one point, so I'm not happy about that. See if you can get that wiper player or not. I'm gonna see if I can get him. Good job on getting the checkpoint though. And I'm dead. I should not have taken damage from that ink storm. I'm gonna see if I can get that charger again. Time for me to be the annoying end zap I know I can be. Like that. Why the heck did I do that? Thanks for the assist, guys. And what's up, Splat Max? Welcome to the stream. Nice. I was half concentrating on that battle the whole time, so thank you guys for the carry. I'm back now. Seriously, though, going back to what I was saying about F-099 real quick, I've been having so much fun with that game. Nice fist bump. But seriously, though, I am F-Zero pilled. That game is so good. I'm seriously considering making that my next stream just to show you guys how awesome it is. Oh, nice, Flagman. Are you an NZAP main? I just chose the NZAP 85 today because that's apparently one of the best weapons for this challenge. And what's up, Bandit Guy? Oh no, Mr. Cheese! Did you disconnect? Hmm. See if you can rejoin, and then... And then we'll get started. There we go. And yeah, it especially helps that the end zap and the splatter shot got that one... Uh, accuracy buff in that one patch. Although, between you and me, to be perfectly honest, I hope that patch gets reversed because the NZAP and the splatter shot are way too good. What? Are you kidding me? First... We had this happen with the first lobby of the stream, and now Aiden is back! Okay, run back! Let's do it! 
And don't worry, Tuesday. Range Blaster is actually going to be pretty useful. Get out of here. We're talking about Smaiden, Nostalgia King. Also, what's up? Welcome to the stream. Hmm, gonna have to go. Be another obnoxious end zap player. That's me. Ouch. Also, what's up, Fry? Welcome to the stream. Are you in this match? If so, then good luck. Other than that, I don't know what you mean by the luck you have. And what's up, Game Spy? Welcome to the stream. Come on, guys. Get the Rainmaker. Get the Rainmaker. Yeah. I really thought you could push it forward just a little bit, but oh well. That's fine. We at least got to the checkpoint. That's what I'm concerned about. Oh, no. I'm dead. The L3D has a good sub, but a bad special. Maybe so, Nostalgia King. But, uh... I do remember there was an L3 Nozzle Nose variant in Splatoon 2 that did have the Ultra Stamp. And at the very least, that one had the Splash Wall. A sub that is also pretty beneficial to the L3. And nice, the enemy team is at the funny number. Oh, Aiden! Come and get me. I'm playing the end zap. I'm supposed to be obnoxious. Don't take it personally, though, Aiden. Funny number achieved, they win. Or, no, it's more like a moral victory, I suppose. What the heck was that? Also, see you later, Chula. Thanks for stopping by. We have got to make sure they don't push anymore. Any more than that, at least. Oh no! Someone on their side disconnected. That's no good. I mean, that means we're probably gonna win, but at the same time, it feels wrong. This has just been one huge cluster of madness for both sides. The curse is spreading, exactly, Prox. I mean, that is true. You can shoot through the Rainmaker, or Ultra Stamp, but it's a very tight window. Also, see you later, Flagman. Nice job on grabbing the Rainmaker. I'll see if I can pick off the enemy team. One. Not two. Oh, well. Hmm. If we can keep them incapacitated, or I guess I should say incapacitated, we'll be good. Never mind, that was a wipeout. Hurry! Get them! Either that or the Rainmaker is gonna get them. How? I'm sorry, what? I call malarkey on that. Excuse me?
Very nice. Let's go. Tactic cooler for all y'all. Get out of here. Push forward. Go. Go. Yeah. Oh, that felt good. The run back from overtime. That is the true GG's right there. And we're so sorry for your disconnect there, Aiden. Whoo! One more battle in this lobby, and then we're gonna swap to a different lobby. My heart was beating that entire battle. Hmm. Hmm. I thought I had something else I wanted to talk about. Dang it. See, here's the thing, Tricolor. It's fine if you want to leave someone else's stream to watch a different streamer. You just shouldn't be rude about it. If you say something like, Oh, I'm gonna go watch someone else. See you later. That's considered rude. If you, if you just tell the streamer that you're leaving, then that's fine. You can say goodbye to him. Just, if you're going to watch another streamer, don't say that. That's considered rude. And yeah, good call there, Nostalgia King. I got eyes on for that Tri-Slasher Nouveau player. Oh no. Okay, we're good. Alright, I took out the Neo Splash. Oh, if you did, then I wouldn't worry about it. Let me tell you guys, YouTube etiquette in streams is a hard thing to learn. Trust me, I've learned about that, well, the hard way. But it's not that hard once you get used to it. Is this the first time we've been on Humpback and had a match that lasted more than 10 seconds? I think it is. Oh no, I'm dead, I'm dead. I'm not dead. Oh, this has been a roller coaster and a half of a challenge. Got him. Now it's my turn. Let's go, guys. That's all right, Dylan. I hope you get your internet issues resolved. Hmm. Wow, okay. That's how you're gonna do it, huh? Wow, my, my bombs all missed. But there we go. Good job, guys. Twice in a row, by the way, that rain, er, range blaster, excuse me. Twice in a row, the range blaster direct shot my respawn armor. Just let me have my cooler before I die.
Wait, what? I saw that. We broke through the checkpoint. Excuse me. I still call shenanigans. And great, the range blaster is being obnoxious as well. In a battle of obnoxiousness, the end zap wins. Hairs down. Or hands down. Whatever the phrase is. I was... I think I was trying to quote Super Mario 64 DS by mistake. Come get your cooler, guys. We're gonna need it if we want to survive. Nice push. Uh, Fry, I'm gonna remove your comment. Splatfests are not rigged, and please do not dogpile characters just because of their choices. I'm not putting you in timeout, but I am gonna remove your comment. We can win this, but I'm going to have to play out of my mind to do so. Also, welcome back, Nathan. I splatted the Rainmaker player, but at what cost? I got blasted. Hmm. Rats. Okay. Is that five battles? I can't remember. I think it is. It was worth a shot, though. GG's, everybody. And that was the fifth battle? I thought so. Hmm. Alright, then. So, yeah. That's gonna be it for this lobby. I'll close it and remake it. And if you were just in that lobby, please do not join again until everyone has played in one lobby. Alright? Alright. I might swap to a different weapon. I don't know if this is going to work. What, though, is the question? Oh, yeah, and before I forget... Where is it? There! Uh, hello? Oh. Right, it's here. View replays. Uh, you? No? Eh, I'll figure it out. I'll do that on my own time. I don't really want to put stream effort to that. And why not? I will play my beloved heavy edit. We need some range. And... Yeah, Tuesday, Mr. Cheese, and Tricolor, please do not join again until everyone else has joined. Thank you. There's the notification. And we got some people. Check battle logs? All right. Trying to figure out what some good strategies are for this. Eh, whatever. I'll think of something. Oh yeah, the stop posting about whatever memes. Those are pretty funny. When they're done correctly. I saw one of those memes that was about Donkey Kong Country, and it was really well done. It's a short, so I don't know how well the link is going to work. 
But if I can find it, I'll put it in the description of the stream. VOD. Eh, it was worth it, though. We destroyed the Rainmaker player. Oh, dear. They have a Vanilla Blaster on their team. I don't know if that's more or less dangerous than a Range Blaster. Oh, never mind, because the Forge Pro got me. Yeah, it might be more dangerous because of the big bubbler. Well, that was certainly a match that happened, wasn't it? GG's, I guess. Yeah, the heavy edit is not going to work for me. I'm sticking with the end zap. And, uh, is it just me or did... Yeah, excuse me. Did that third inkling kind of look like Vasco's inkling? It's not them, but it did really look like Vasco's inkling. Alright, I'm switching to... Hmm. Try the Splattershot Nova? Okay, but I'm going to try the Anarchy Nova because I'm way more familiar with that one. This could work. Ah, you're trying the uh the Neo Sploosh Splat Max. Interesting choice. Ugh, excuse me. I don't know why I got so much gas in me today. Oh, okay. This is going to be interesting. Time to see if I can make that vanilla heavy player have a bad day. The Splattershot Nova, specifically this version, does have a good kit. My issue is... The damage output of the main weapon is atrocious. It's a five-shot splat on a shooter that has way less deviation than the arrow spray, which is also a five-shot splat. How am I supposed to defeat my opponents with the main weapon? That's what I've never gotten about the Splattershot Nova. Which is weird because I'm actually pretty good with the Anarchy Nova. But none of that matters when you have the Rainmaker. Not even the close range version got him. Dang. That was a pretty good push on my part, and I was doing a speech for half of it. Let me see if I can do something about this. Try and hit me if you can, Heavy. There you go. Deserved. Hmm. What to do now? I mean... I was on Team Marie for the final Splatfest in Splatoon 1, so I think I am going to have to go with her. Although I do like both of the Squid Sisters. I just like Marie more. Come on. Oh, wait. Chat, I have a question for you guys. Do any of you know if Object Shredder applies to the Rainmaker shield? Yes or no? Because if it does, I might start running Object Shredder more frequently. 
If it doesn't, then I'll see if I can pick a different, a different pair of shoes. It does apply to the Rainmaker shield. Nice. I knew I had a good feeling. Yeah, that's that was GG's from all the way down there. Man. This challenge is stupid fun, but the problem is we keep getting absolutely slaughtered in terms of weapon choices. Like, what am I supposed to do? Seriously. I might just pick up the T-Tech. I don't know. I'm running out of ideas. You either play Splatoon 3 long enough to be a hero, or play it long enough to see yourself become a meta-slave. And at this point, I don't care. I'm trying anything at least once. Just so I can have some good matchmaking power. No offense, guys. I just needed a little me time there. Exactly, Nathan! That's what I'm saying, too! I normally am not a meta slave. I main the heavy splatling, the vanilla version, and I'm proud of it. But I will not hesitate to dig up a meta weapon if it means I do well, you know? My point exactly with the enemy team, because holy mackerel, that weapon comp is scary. It also doesn't help that I'm a terrible aim with bomb weapons normally. Or pretty much any sub or special that's thrown. That basically means, Mr. Cheese, it means weapons that people consider to be really good. Weapons that are, like, universally considered to be good. The Tenetech Splatter Shot is one of them. The NZAP 85 is another one. The Tri Slosher Nouveau is another one. At least from what I've seen. But yeah. In general, multiplayer games like these, when... When people say a character or a weapon is meta, they mean it's really, really good. Kind of like Meta Knight in Super Smash Bros. Brawl. Oh boy, that was a time. Brawl was my first ever Smash Bros. game, so I was subjected to the terror that was Brawl Meta Knight. Oh, I have, I have my stream chat pulled up on my computer, and I have the game pulled up on a separate monitor, Fry. That's how that works. Come on, push forward! If you can. Well, that's a start at least. Oh no. Am I in trouble? I might be in trouble. Yeah, I am if I can't aim my splat bombs. What's wrong with me, man? I thought it would be really funny if I could shoot it through those holes. There we go. Get out of here. I was for sure in trouble, Nathan. <laughs> Get out of here. Oh no. I'm just gonna stop you right there, Wave Breaker. 
Well, I splatted someone, it just wasn't the Tri Nouveau player. You knew what I meant, Mr. Cheese. Trust me, though, I've said out-of-context stuff on stream before. This isn't the first time. Wow, my kamikaze shot actually worked. Yeah, pretty much, Tuesday. And dang, I got a triple. I'm impressed. I rarely get stuff like that. There you go, get out of here. Cover me, guys. I'm gonna see if I can push. going for it okay I at least got rid of the uh, the blob lobber player oh hey I can do this there you go hopefully that helped great now I want chicken nuggets Come on, quit being a coward. Coward. GG's, I guess. I swear we're gonna get a win one of these centuries. Uh, that bashful brag emote is so toxic. I'm going back to the end zap. I've had the best luck with that. Honestly, I wouldn't doubt it, Nathan. I would not doubt that for a second if Side Order had something like that. Or wait. We still got two more battles, guys. Don't leave. Ready up, Splat Max. We're waiting on you. Oh, wait. You're getting something at the Crab and Go. Good call. And just a heads up, if anyone else wants to join, since this lobby is going to be ending soon, here's the pool code. Alright, let's do this. Also, what's up, Zai? Welcome to the stream. Yeah, I did face Aiden twice. We lost the first time, but won the second. And I guess we're back to Inkblot. I did not expect that. Or maybe I did, I don't know. It's a 50-50 either way. Oh geez, they have a 96 gal player on their team. I'm terrified. And an S-Blast. Very bold choices from the enemy team. And they already pushed it. Okay, we might be in trouble. How much special power-up is that 96 gal player packet? I want to know. 
I gotta look at their gear setup later. And <laughs> nice. I got that S Blast player with a tap shot. Thanks for the. Thanks for the cover, guys. I needed that. Push forward. Yeah, nice. Very nice push. Good job, guys. GG's. I told you matches like this would end in seconds. We didn't even get through a full loop of the background song, by the way. Nice fist bump. I still think my favorite challenge is the random weapon one. But this one is pretty high up there, too. This one is easily top three. And you know, that's a good idea. My top three favorite challenges are probably the random weapon challenge first, followed by the high jump challenge, and then this. Uh, Splat Max, we got one more. If you want to rejoin, please do so we can... So we can get this challenge power calculated. But yeah, the high jump challenge was insanely fun. And I'm sad I wasn't able to stream it. GameSpy, if someone else joins, then we'd lose out on the calculation power. Or the power calculation. So it might be better if I just break the lobby now. I might as well. You know what the worst part about that swim speed challenge was? I never got to play the swim speed challenge at all. The time frames were so horrible for my personal schedule. I just didn't have time. And that's so annoying. I really hope the swim speed challenge gets a rerun soon. And if you guys need the pool code, here it is. You gotta go to this envelope menu here to join a pool. I say wait for now, Game Spy. Unless, or in case there are people that want to join. Oh, Nostalgia King, if you're still here, then you're more than welcome to join. I don't know if they left. You never played the high jump challenge Tuesday? That was a fun challenge. I honestly hope that one gets rerun too. So I can stream it. I'm gonna send out another invite just in case. Oh, never mind. There's Nostalgia King. Alright. If anyone else wants to take that last spot, there we go. Alright. Let's see if we can get a full set of five battles in for this lobby. What's the poll looking like? Hmm, okay. The general consensus seems to be... This challenge is very fun. We're ready when you are, Nostalgia King. While that's going on, let me check something.
Oh, hey, I might have to watch that later. Eh, I might raid them if they're still alive. Oh, well, let's see what happens. For a second there, I thought we ran into the same team again. Or, one of our teams from before. But no, this is a new squad. Ooh, they have a Big Swig Express on their team. Very bold choice. I feel like you barely see any Big Swig Express players nowadays. It seems like more people play the vanilla Big Swig. Also, welcome Terminal to the stream. It's been a while, man. Hope you've been well. This challenge reminds you of the original Rainmaker from Splatoon 1. Oh! Oh, wait! You're mentioning that reminded me! You guys are never going to believe this, but I actually set up my old Wii U. I can stream on it if I want to. So long as it still works. There is a very realistic chance I'll be able to play Splatoon 1 with you guys before it shuts down in April. And I couldn't be happier because I've always wanted to play Splatoon 1 on stream. I still got to figure out some internet connectivity issues that I've been having with my Wii U. But there might be Splatoon 1 content on this channel for the first time within the coming months. Don't you dare. Get out of here, machine. By the way, the slashing machine is another weapon that people consider meta. Nice push, Mr. Cheese. Get out of here. Hmm, where's everyone else? Okay, I actually got my cooler this time. Aw, oh, man. They got me on the backswing. Oh, dear. Get out of here. You too. Before I die via the Booyah Bomb, I wanted to get rid of the Rainmaker. And there we go. I am not sure how that Sploosh player survived all of that. We're probably going to have just enough time for one more lobby after this, Zai, if you want to join. The pool code for the stream is in the description and in the pinned comment at the top of the chat. That's what you got to enter. And I'm going to do it. No guts, no glory. Hey, thanks for the push, enemy team. Thanks for nothing. Get them! So that's... That's a little weird. I'm gonna have to talk about that in a minute. I got splatted, but I didn't hit the Rainmaker player at all. Dang it. Oh, yeah, I know what you're talking about. That's because that's a pun. 
in French, the Squid Sisters' names are Ayo and Oli. Together, they make a type of sauce, aioli. Get out of here, Carbon. Smart idea, Prox. I have a feeling if... I'll talk about that in a second. Hang on. I'm kind of fighting for my life. Okay. I have a feeling if Nintendo did give this Rainmaker a 60-second timer, it would be way too busted. So that's why it has a 30-second timer instead. I'm going straight to the Rainmaker goal. No, taking no chances, baby. Or not. Get that! Yeah, let's go! Oh, that was way too close. This challenge has been fun, but... I feel kind of bad, though, in a way. Because a lot of the things that have been hampering this challenge have basically been out of my control. I wanted this experience to be enjoyable for all of us, you know? But I do agree that was a crazy battle. 19 KOs. Yo, Prox with the 21 KOs. You love to see it. Don't leave just yet, by the way. We got four more battles in this lobby. Ready up, Nostalgia King and Mr. Cheese. We're waiting on you guys. Uh-oh. For a second there, I thought the stream froze. Never mind. We're good. It's just my stream preview having a fit again. Ah, you're switching to the Custom Junior. Okay. Good choice, good choice. It really depends on how quickly these last few battles go, Zai. If you rewind in the stream VOD, we've had some pretty quick battles. Also, Mr. Cheese, ready up. I'll break the lobby if you don't. There we go. Good job. Custom jet, okay. We do need range. Your birthday's coming up soon? Well, first off, happy birthday, Fry. And second, the default best option is spending time with your family. And don't worry, Mr. Cheese, you were... Or, excuse me, you're good. I'm sorry, what the heck is this? If Aiden is still live by the time we're done streaming, I might raid them. This is the third time I'd like to point out. I'm definitely going to make a note of this whenever I post my end of stream tweet. Wow, I ran right into that Trizuka. Okay. Remind me to never do that again. That is a good call, though, Tricolor. Because I was thinking about playing a little bit of F-099 before the end of the stream, but hmm, I'll think about it. Wow, how did that suction bomb not hit anybody? 
Yeah, there was no way I was making that. Oops. I gotta remember to stop falling off of that ledge. But yeah, going back to my point earlier, most of the things that have been hampering this stream have been out of my control. And I hate that. And I guess we can all agree that Rainmaker Humpback stinks. Three more battles in this lobby and then we'll see what happens next. Ooh, the no Blech. I almost said the the never edit. No, the Nautilus. I was trying to say the Nautilus, the heavy splatling and the heavy edit at the same time, so it came out just a massive bundle of jargon. Okay. What's next? Okay, we're back to Inkblot. I can handle this. This is a Rainmaker map that I'm... Okay, they have an E-Leader. We're dead. But still, this is a Rainmaker map that I'm comfortable with. Well, time for me to be obnoxious again. Get out of here. Just let me have my cooler. Thank you. Get some cooler before that Trizuka splats, you guys. Seriously, though. This is just like my undertow spillway big run stream all over again. If that one particular corner of Undertow is what I now call the timeout corner, the cliff right next to the spawn in Humpback is that map's timeout corner. Dang it, I can't aim. Oh, that's 100% true, Tricolor. Nice, we traded. Dang, this person's really good at Salmon Run. Speaking of which, I know I brought this up briefly in my community tab, but the next Salmon Run stream I do with viewers is just going to be a normal Salmon Run stream. It's going to be a long while before I bust out the challenge wheel again. I want to wait until the rotation is just right. Dagnabbit. Also, you didn't really miss much, Scarlet. And welcome back. We are probably going to be ending the stream after this lobby's over. Oh no, I'm dead. Wow, the splat bomb got me. Yesterday's Salmon Run rotation was pretty goaded. It was! I was so sad I chose not to stream on that day because I would have loved to. That Salmon Run rotation had the Grizzco Slosher, which is my favorite Grizzco weapon in the game. Well, second favorite. My favorite is the Stringer.
Seriously, though, the Grizzco Slosher is amazing. It's one of the best ways to take down the armored boss salmonids, like steelheads and flyfish. Even Drizzlers are no match for the Grizzco Slosher. And it tears through lessers like you wouldn't believe. I really hope the next time the Grizzco Slosher is in rotation, I'm able to do a Salmon Run stream. Because I want to show you guys just how broken it is. If I had my wits about me, I could have recorded it for a short. I did not mean to do that. But yeah, see? See that? See those two poles connecting to that lamp right there? I was trying to throw a suction bomb through that little gap, but it didn't work. The gap was too small, and the suction bomb was too big. Or no, it was a splat bomb. Never mind. Point still stands. Gap too small for really big bomb. The Grizzco Dooleys are pretty good, but they're not my favorite. I feel like that was a little overhyped. Get me that Rainmaker! I need backup! That high and mighty E-leader player wasn't so high and mighty, huh? Even though we still lost. But that was very close! We can't say that we didn't try. That was pretty good. GG's. Also, welcome Bennett to the stream. We're gonna be ending the stream soon, in about two more matches, I think. Yeah, two more, and then after that we'll raid someone. If that actually is the reason, Scarlet, then I'm gonna be slightly annoyed. Hmm... Let me look. Has anyone else gone live since then? Hmm, I just raided them, so that's gonna be a no-go. Oh, and if you guys need the pool code, it is that. And yes, that is terminal. Your health comes first. And okay, I've got multiple raid targets. Wait, hang on, hang on, I have an idea, I have an idea. Mr. Cheese, Prox, and Nostalgia King. If you guys can rejoin the lobby, we'll be able to get our total challenge power. There's Prox. There's Mr. Cheese. But yeah, if the Nostalgia King is still here, if you can rejoin, we'll be able to still get our challenge power. I'll send out another notification just in case. All right, I'll wait. Your game crashed? Oh! Uh, okay then, that makes more sense. But yeah, I don't mind waiting. We've only got two more battles with this group anyway. 
And I'm gonna change my music here before I go insane. No, not you. I don't wanna... Oh, wait, I can't do that. Because I'm in a lobby. Oh, well. This is a pretty good song, though, you gotta admit. Uh, unfortunately, Bennett, I don't really have good tips. I'm not as well-versed at Rainmaker or any ranked mode as some other YouTubers are. But hey, don't be afraid to ask around. Oh, that's right! Uh, Sage, if you don't mind... If you don't mind leaving the lobby, Sage, we're trying to get a challenge power calculated. If you're here. Hmm. Thank you kindly. Room's open, Nostalgia King. Let me send out the notification again. Refresh your notifications room now. You should be able to see it, Nostalgia King. There you go. I'm sticking with the end zap. And thank you for understanding, Sage. I just didn't want this to be ruined. Also, welcome. Hope you're doing well. I haven't been, though. I've been having absolutely trash luck with this challenge, despite it being so fun. Oh, hang on. Gotta clear my throat. I need to mute for this. There we go. That's happened to me before, Terminal, when I've been playing on my own time. So I know what you mean. Okay, they have a Squiffer player. That's not bad. I can deal with Squiffers, Goo Tubers, and Bamboozlers. It's that Octobrush player that I'm scared of. I have to make sure that Octobrush player gets little breathing room. Same with the Junior player. They can be just about as obnoxious as an Enzap. And right, I got rid of the Rainmaker. I'll see if I can provide cover. There you go. What even? Oh! I thought the Junior got me. Oops. I got someone. It wasn't the Rainmaker holder, but I got someone. That's what you get. Get out of here with that malarkey and never do that to me again. I love this Rainmaker challenge so much. Dang it. <laughs> Which shooter is more obnoxious, the Junior or the Enzap? Oh yeah, Terminal. For this challenge, whenever you have the Rainmaker equipped, you essentially have a Tacticooler buff. Unfortunately, Bennett, this challenge is going to be ending pretty soon, so unless Nintendo decides to rerun this, it'll be a while before we see it again, I'm afraid. So I wanted to make sure to have all of us enjoy it while it lasts. 
Ugh. I gotta drink some water or something after we raid. Because my throat is really starting to hurt. Out of here. Imagine they do rerun it, but they nerf it. Eh, that would probably make the most sense. I mean, I had my fair share of gamer rage in this stream, but it wasn't anything like my last Salmon Run stream, because that was a nightmare. If you guys didn't see my last Splatoon 3 Salmon Run stream, be thankful you didn't. It was a nightmare. I have that stream unlisted for a reason. Ah, dang it! They're gonna win, aren't they? No, they're not! Nice job, whomever did that. I'm gonna see if I can do the funny. Give me that. All right, I'm doing it. Serves you right, enemy team. Yeah, even if you do the Rainmaker reset trick, the buffs from when you were carrying it still apply. Come get your cooler. And I'm sorry, how did that get me? That sloshing machine was lagging something fierce. To be fair, Fry, I've lasted longer than this without drinking water before. It's just been a little strenuous on my voice because of all the gamer rage I've been having. Oh no. Ugh, I was scared from a, from a little life. I'll take that. GG's. But for real, though, I will get water after this stream is over, because, ooh, boy, am I going to need it. And hey, the enemy team ended on the funny number. No fist bump. Oh, well. And dang it! The challenge just ended! We barely didn't get a challenge power. I'm so sorry, guys, if you were in that lobby. If only that emote was compatible. Yeah, I agree. Okay. That was a pretty solid win, though. I will agree. That was a great match to go out on. Okay, I guess it's my turn to pop off. Jeez. That is a that is a great way to go. Now let's gamba. All right, new decorations. And a food ticket. Okay. So, that is going to be it for this stream. Don't go anywhere. It's time for the raid. And my next stream is going to be, if it'll load, give it a second. Yes, I will be playing more F-099 in my next stream. However, if I can stream before then, it'll be more Metopia. I really want to show you guys all of the new tracks that were added and how much better I've gotten at this game. And it's been a while since I've had you.
But okay, let me see whom we're gonna be raiding. Don't go anywhere just yet. You know what? Aiden is still live? They've got one more battle? Let's raid them. We're raiding Smaden. I think it would be nice to pay him a visit after we ran into them like three separate times. So, the link to Aiden's stream will appear after I end mine. And when you get there, type hashtag tentacle raid in the chat. Like I said, my next stream will either be more F099 this weekend or Metopia on a weekday this week. I don't know when. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, despite all the scuff. And until next time, this is Tentacles signing out. Take care, everybody.